nothing this go around. Nothing yet, at least. Oh, spoke too soon. <laughs> slab a rab -a -roo. What is good? What is good, all my real ones? Welcome back to another It Gets Real adventure. It's your boy, B, the Flossy Fisherman. And today, we are at Calero Park. Out here, trying to target some bass because this is the very first place I caught my very first bass. You know, spring is amongst us. The bass are bedding. It's almost pre-spawn, if not spawning season for them. So what they do is lie on their beds to protect their eggs. And um, you know, they get real defensive. So pretty much strike at anything if you could find them laying up on your beds. And, uh, oh. Somebody took a spill. Oh no. Oh, gotta be careful on these docks out here. Got my, my Ned rig set up. So I got my wacky worms, my wacky rigs, and trying to whack them. <laughs> Meeting up with the homie pack out here. You know, gonna try to do some damage, man. So Y'all keep it locked and see if your boy can't hook up on something. Yeet! Pac-Man, Pac-Man. Slamming, slamming. Yes, sir. What's good with you? Not too much, man. Just caught two on this frostbite right here. Ooh. Seven grammar, so. Yeah, man. We've been playing all day, go. but this is it. This is ticking as well. So here I am using the Ray Rod seven foot tarantula ultralight. Two pound test on the Shimano Stratic 1000. And just like that, and just like that, we on, ladies and gentlemen. Got, Got a pack em. on them. Got them once again. Woo wee, look at this. Labaroo. Double up, look at this, double up. Hey. <laughs> Got them. Cheers. <laughs> Slab City. <laughs> hey, we got a little crisscross jump in. Crisscross to make you. Ain't no crappy day today. Oh no, for sure not a crappy day. <laughs> man, oh man, what a crazy change of events. Came out here trying to get bassy on them. Pack throws out one of the outcaster spoons and starts smacking crappy. So guess what I did, man? I had to throw on a spoon myself. And man, whoo, these crappie are smacking. Using the seven gram Palomino. So we're casting, letting it drop for about seven seconds. Work that lower column. And slow retrieve. The seven gram is cutting against the wind. So we still get a lot of distance. Plus the weight is giving us that distance, so it's working out real well. As you can see, <laughs> pack, <like> is, <laughs> pack is hooked up again. <laughs> Love crappy days like this. <laughs> oh, there was one following it in. What? Either that was another crappie or it was a big freaking bass. <laughs> Slabaroo. Crazy hookups. I got them again. It's a bass. Yeah, I told you. <laughs> Larchy on the board? Yup. What? Hell yeah, isn't that a little nice nice? Not bad at all. Look at you, little Mr. Bass. Alright, so we switching it up to the Ned Rig, the Blue Lightning, Ray Rod, seven foot two piece. Line weight is eight pounds to 17 pounds. The lure weight is three eighths of an ounce to one and one fourth of an ounce. Paired up with my Daiwa Legalis 2500. Got 10 pound braid on here. About to try to go to where I caught my first bass ever. 
Now the bass are in a lot closer because they're bedding. First time I caught a bass, I just casted it out as far as I could and boom, it hit on the drop. Tiny guy, little dinkster. But uh, if I remember correctly, there is an opening over here. Still here, very shallow though. It's another access point. Hopefully we can get something. And we on, we on baby. <laughs> no way, double up. Look at that y'all, double. Oh shoot, yeah that stuff went right past my face. <laughs> Trying to give me another ear piercing dog. <laughs> Dude, all day, what? <laughs> On the outcaster spoon, man. All day. Man, look at these slabs. You seen that double up, boy? In California, the crappie limit is 25. There's no size limit. But all these guys are about 14s, 15s, man. All right, gonna cast this thing on out. <laughs> out goes that cast. <laughs> Working with a monster. Yeah. You want to bust out a measure on them? 13 and, 13 and a half. 13 and three quarters. Yep. Almost 14. Oh, man. Fire. I'm loving that, that golden poppy, man. Yo, this is another freaking slaver. Toad. That tarantula thing. Dude, we doubling up all day, bro. Doubling up all day. So <laughs> oh, this fight is so lovely on this ultralight, dude. The tarantula, bruh. The tarantula, slay day. Right? Look at this, bro. Slay day. Another freaking tank. Cheers! The Ray Rod Tarantula. With panfish such as bluegill, crappie, um, you want a softer tip just for that bite. So when you do set the hook on them, it doesn't rip it right out of its mouth. So if you have like an extra fast action, a more stiffer rod with more backbone, chances of uh, when you set that hook for fish like that, you're gonna rip the hook right out of his mouth. So this gives it a lot more play. You see the bend right here. Gives you a lot more play to handle those smaller fish like that. Weighs little to nothing. It casts like a beauty. It has the orange highlights on the guides right here. And this is uh, used just as a bite detector. So you can see that tip of the rod. Really got to put it to work today and <laughs> yeah, I'm digging it, man. I'm digging it. Only thing I'm mad about is this water being so dirty. Cause they would be coming home <laughs> with me. Here they go. Ooh. Here they go. Go ahead, little buddy. Go ahead, little feller. Come on, man. Get with it, get with it, the other way. Come on, what are you doing? Oh, making me touch this nastiness. See, because of this stuff right there, I can't eat you. No radioactive fish for me. Come on. Let's get you going, homie. bunch of algae there you go he on his way creeping through the slime y'all see that y'all see that y'all see that y'all see that see that tip see that going off ooh, ooh. 
this Shimano Stratic thing. Ooh, killing them out here, man. We are straight slamming, baby. Oh! Ooh. This is a pillar. This one's a pillar. Come on, fella. Ooh, he a slabber boy. Slabber. Slabber dabber do. Oh. <coughs> oh. He get you? <laughs> Hell yeah, man. You should eat you for that. I'm not trying to get hooked. But he's well on his way to try to get me hooked. <laughs> Dude, that is a fatty right there, man. Woo! Splash me. Splash me and everything. Ugh. Ugh. Got all this nasty water on me, yo. Splash my cam too. Look at this, man. Should really eat this guy for that, dude. I don't go. See, I ain't got no waders, man. So I ain't walking out in that muck and that yucky stuff. Didn't really come out here with intentions to get no crappie, but hey, due to the mercury in this water and the uh, algae and all that, this is probably like one of the most highest and unsafe lakes out there to eat from. You see it. You see that stuff. We were catching and releasing everything, man. Tighten this up a little bit. Tighten up the drag for the slab. Look at he 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 gulped it. It was all in his mouth. On the creamsicle? On the creamy. Creamsicle, bro. Original. Yeah. Original spoon right there. Oh, that's all the way back there, bro. Ooh. He slammed it. Oh my gosh. Do y'all see that? Ooh. That's way back there on his tongue. <laughs> like, what was you doing, guy? Hungry. Hungry, hungry. Feeling like a dentist right now. Shoot, man. Say ah. Woo! Yeah, we got it. Just hold on a second. Chunky one. On that drop shot. Okay. There you go. She says 288. We'll take it. All right. I appreciate it, man. No problem. On the drop shot, huh? There you go. They caught a bass over there, man. We just weighed them out. Um, Pac actually caught a bass too. I had one, but he shook the hook right before I could bring him in. Mm, nothing this go around. Nothing yet, at least. Oh, spoke too soon. <laughs> oh, they like jumping on my stuff. What? You got a little parkour action going again? <laughs> Oh my gosh, man. Oh, that was a bass. I'm enjoying this crappie bite. Only thing I'm, I'm kind of down about is that this water's so bad I can't take them home and put them in the frying pan. Look at this. Golly. Oh my goodness, bro. Yeah, you might need to get the tape measure for him. 16, maybe? 16, 17, I don't know. 14 and a half. 14 and a half, Rosie. Short of 14 and a half, but yeah. Okay. Yeah. This is what we want. Look bigger. <laughs> Pack, is it safe to say you had a crappy day? I did have a crappy day, Rosie. <laughs> Just kept spoon feeding them fish, you know what I'm saying? Pack slammed it, caught about 15 crappie today. Now, on the outcaster spoons and ray rods all day, bro. Yeah, man. Follow my Come guy, Pack the outcaster. Hit that subscribe button for your boy one time and that notification bell. And follow me on It Gets Real Fishing on Facebook and Instagram. You know, you see the drip, you see the fit. Hop on itgetsreal.com, man. And um, you can look at some of the merch we got on there and use code real one for 10% off your next purchase. But till the next time, y'all be cool, y'all be blessed, peace.